Okay, well I've taken this apart here. This is at least something I can do for free. I was right what I said before about I thought that the key lock there was disconnected. Was disconnected, that the, 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 the um, rod was disconnected and I was right. There it is hanging there. So that's what's happened there. That, that's the rod for the key lock. I don't know if I can get it in the picture or not, but well, let me back up a bit. There we go. There it is. There. I got my hand on it. I'm sure you can't see it, but I got my fingers on it. Anyway, and it attaches right here. You can actually see the little plastic. Well, actually, you probably can't see it, but anyway, it attaches. Um, well, anyway, I can't show you, but there's a, yeah. Anyway, I know where it attaches, but I'll attach that again, I guess. Maybe it'll stay in place. Maybe it won't. I don't know. This is such a stupid jerry rig setup. You can see what he did here. I'm going to have to... I don't know why people do. I just don't understand it. Anyway, I'm going to have to drill the holes out bigger. And then I'm going to have to put some, some bolts with nuts, basically, to hold that all in place. Uh, at least I should be able to get my hand in here fairly easily to do it. There's, that's a good thing. But, yeah, it's a mess anyway. All right, like I say, I'm not putting any more money into this, at least until my repair bill is paid up. Then maybe, possibly, I'll put more money into it, but no, I'm not going to be, you know, I mean, this, this truck just isn't worth what it's costing, so. And I mean, it, when, when they hit 300,000 kilometers, that's when they do start breaking down constantly. And that's why it used to be that's when we'd start looking for a new vehicle, you know, in the old days when things made more sense. But we're living in a world now, we're living in a bizarre world now, so. Anyway, I've got to figure out what I'm going to use. i got a bunch of fasteners in, in here, so I'll just see if I can cobble something together. What a friggin' wreck. What a stupid thing. <laughs> you know. Ah. Uh. I'll tell you, I do not like it. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, but I figured it out. I had $4,000 of the $15,000 that I was in debt paid off. I've now run that back up for, for, for fuel and propane and food. Um, I've, uh, my savings of $5,000 is gone, and I'm $1,500 in debt for repairs, and now all this is happening, so. I think you can see what I mean when I say I can't keep doing this. You know, I really can't. And this truck, there's no prospect that this truck is going to earn its keep, not at this point. Because the thing is, the more I work, the more I work with it, the more I'll be driving it. And the more I drive it, the more it's going to break down. And every time it breaks down, it's anywhere, you know, who knows what. You won't get out of the garage without spending $500 at least. Well, I mean, i got to put in a lot of hours working to earn $500. And, and that's cheap. It's usually a lot more than that. So, like I say, I, I just can't keep doing it. That's all. Let me see here. I've got these here. Ah, I can't get that out of there very easily. You can see here. I'm wondering about these here. Ah, I'm wondering about these here. Ah, let me look and see. They're kind of big. So I don't know, but let's see here. I'm wondering about these things here, if I may be able to use them. I think they may be a little big, though. And I'll have to find the nuts to put on them. But yeah, if I drill the holes out a little more, that could work. Maybe, possibly, it could. We'll see. I gotta find nuts to put on them, though. Anyway, I got a bunch of nuts in here, too, so we'll see. Alright, that's it. Uh, maybe I can at least get the door fixed so it stops screwing up. That'd be nice. There's my big box of drill bits. Bring them down. I do. Okay. Now. Yeah, but yeah, I'm just about done anyway. Here we go now. Let me see. God, eh? Okay now. Huh. Mm. 
Okay, I'll have to have a look and see. Those are wood bits. I think these might be good for steel, but I'm not sure. And, uh, yeah, I don't know. We'll see anyway. I'll have to look. All right, we'll talk to you later.